What's going on everyone and welcome back to Minion Simulator where today guys I'm gonna show you how you really don't need to have the plus 16 equip or the plus 8 equip in order for you to make 1 billion candy in just 3 minutes. That's right, 1 billion candy in 3 minutes. Now this method that I'm gonna show you guys, I don't think that they intended to do this. I think that the game, once they realize what that this method actually exists, I think that they're gonna nerf it. So watch the entire video and get to work because this is insane. Now before we go ahead and use the method to get all that candy, what I wanna show you guys is with four dark matter vampires, if I use that and I have both of my boosts on, triple gems and triple damage what I want to do next is I just want to sit on top of the hell chest and see how much candy I can get now bear in mind that this recording right now has been done before x2 right now if you enter the game you see like x2 candy and so these results or at least the the first half of the video I'm just gonna put a note to show you guys which one was the first half and then the second half which is during x2 now if you notice these four dark matter vampires they give me 2.3 million candy during x2 obviously it's going to be double that it's going to be 4.6 but if you notice this one dark matter not four not eight not 16 just that one dark matter pet if you add that number that you just saw 1 million 294 then whatever the other numbers are once you add these two numbers up these two sequences you're gonna notice that it is 2.1 million because this pet whether you have four of them or just that single one it fluctuates between 2.1 million to 2.3 so what this made me do is it made me experiment using other pets but only using one pet because I realized that one pet actually worked out better than having four or eight or even 16 and I can go up to 17 and still one pet worked out better this dark matter killer clown gets you between 3.6 to up to 3.9 that's the numbers I got using both boosts on now you have to also bear in mind even this Dracula here that's one Dracula as you can see one Dracula and if I use just one Dracula I can get 5.6 million now let's see what happens when I use five Draculas why five because at that time that's all I had 5.5 million as you guys can see it does not matter whether I have one pet or five pets so I stuck to using one pet only and at one point I also forgot to boost the triple damage and then I realized that I really don't need triple damage all I needed to have is just the triple gems boost for whatever reason I know it doesn't make any sense I just needed to have the triple gem boost on and what happened if I activated the triple damage it only gave me like a difference of something like two three four million difference that's it so it's really not worth it if you think about it now this rainbow ghost gets me like really awesome numbers like 7.8 million and it goes up to like 8.2 I've seen 8.2 before and we have here it's 8.8.1 all right so that's the hell chest I want to show you guys the difference if I go to the heaven chest what's the difference between the heaven chest and the hell chest I noticed that the numbers are very very similar a little bit sometimes it's a little bit less in the heaven chest and sometimes it's almost the same but the only thing is when you go to the hell chest you save between three to four seconds so the hell chest is much faster to break than this heaven chest that's the only difference that I notice it doesn't matter which pet you have if you use the same method I'm, that I'm showing you as I'm going along you're gonna notice the same thing between the hell chest and the heaven chest it's just three to four seconds apart and I'm here to interrupt all of this because I wanted to explain the next clip what happened was I really needed to have a holographic Hydra because with a 50 billion power pet I needed to show you guys exactly how much you can get the maximum amount of candy in the shortest time possible so I needed to get that pet which to me was the easiest way to get it because I don't have 40 or 45 million gold to spend on one so this was the easiest way and this is what happened now with that rainbow ghost giving me 8.1 million candy, can you even imagine how much I can get with this 50 billion power pet, the holographic hydra? Oh, okay, I did that by mistake, but you know what? No regrets, no regrets. Let's just click on it and see what happens. Maybe I can get it, maybe not. 
Oh no! All right, okay. I mean, 50% chance. 35% on the Dracula. That's only 13%. Ah, uh, so tempted! It's so tempting to do 800 Robux spent. I mean, I, I might as well do this. I might as well just go ahead and spend the 2,400 Robux. Either cry in the corner or just be extremely happy. Who knows? Holographic Hydra. Let's go! Let's go! Let's test this out. Come on! Come on! Come on! Let's go! <gasps> no way! No way that. That did not just happen. Oh my, oh my gosh. And that actually did happen, guys. That is, that was amazing. 800 Robux, then 2,400 Robux. That's insane. Because this is the huge headless horseman with only 1.5% chance to get. And that was super, super lucky of me to get it. So let's get back to topic and see exactly how you can get 1 billion candy in just 3 minutes. Let's go. Part 2 of the Halloween event is here and they have released a bunch of stuff. They never disappoint their players, which is absolutely awesome, but check this out. This is the new pet, Jason. 50 million candy with only one of that. One Jason and that's it. All you need to do is activate your triple gems boost and get this pet and just sit here for 5 minutes and you can get 1 billion candy just for 5 minutes. That is absolutely insane. I have calculated and timed everything and Jason can get you 1 billion candy in 5 minutes. The same goes for this dark matter ghost because it gives you the same amount of candies as Jason does. 47, 50 million, that seems to be, it fluctuates, it depends. It could be different for you, but for me it gives me something between like 46 to 51 and so on and so forth. Now we are approaching the most interesting part of this video, which is this holographic Hydra. Now I don't have a Dark Matter Jackson Skelly, but I would imagine it costs a lot. So I'm better off showing you guys how to do this with a holographic Hydra. And this pet is crazy. Look at these numbers. I mean 76 million, that's only with the Triple Gems booster on. And what I want to show you guys to prove my point is this. I'm going to time it. As you can see on the right, there is 7.59 billion gems. I have frozen the frame right now so you can pay attention to that. As soon as I see the hell chest appear on the top of my screen, that's when I'm going to start the timer. And when I stop it is when I see 8.59 billion. And that's all it is. Let's go ahead and do this. 7.59, that's a lot, guys. I have stayed about two hours trying to go through 8 billion candy and I eventually got the huge Jackson Skelly which is absolutely amazing and I'm not gonna let you guys sit through a really boring process but I just wanted to prove that I have the triple gems on only and I just had to boost again to make sure all right so let's go ahead and speed this and see how it goes because I can just sit here and claim that I can get this done in three minutes and you'll be like oh where's the proof so, you know, why not? This is a lot of fun. Here is the proof. This is how long it's going to take you to get 1 billion candy with only the triple gems booster on. That's it. Not triple damage. There is only a slight difference between them and you're going to find that out for yourselves. So get ready. Look at that. That's almost, that is almost there. I'm going to freeze the frame as well. And here we go. 8.59 is when I stop the timer. That is 3 minutes and 16 seconds. That is not what I said, which I, I said since the beginning that you can do this in 3 minutes. So here's the final test. We're going to activate triple damage and we're going to activate triple gems. Restart the timer. It's going to be at 8.73 billion candy. Here's the timer at 0. As soon as I see the Halloween chest drop or just appear in the top of the menu or the top of the screen, I'm going to click on start. So here we go. 8.73 we want to see 9.73 billion and stop the timer there and we have both the triple damage and the triple gems look at those numbers 70 73 million that's it's it's just between 70 to 73 million that's what it that's the difference that's what happens it fluctuates oh we got 69 million as well both times and this video is you can see it's just really sped up and 
Look at that, look how close we are. Boom, there you go. Two minutes and 52 seconds to get one billion candy. That is bonkers, guys. That is, that's crazy. I wish I had a Dark Matter Jackson Skelly just to see how much, how much quicker it could be. But if you have the means to get this Hydra, go ahead and get it, try this out yourselves. And let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if this is too much, too expensive, I would recommend to settle for maybe Jason because there are a few cost effective ways for you to obtain Jason. First of all is from the Halloween gift, as you can see where it says new gift tomorrow up there. That's because I already claimed the gift and that seems to drop every 24 hours. So if you're lucky and you get your Halloween gift and you just go ahead and open it, if you're lucky enough, you might get Jason. If not, you can buy Halloween gifts on the market. People sell them between 2.5 to 3.5 million. That seems to be that price range for it. Or you can go ahead and buy Jason yourselves and it costs between 67 million as of right now. So the bottom line is this, if you can afford the Hydra, if you have one yourselves, go ahead and test out this method, go ahead and have fun with that. If you don't, the best thing I would say or I would recommend is to get Jason as the minion that you use because you can get 1 billion candy in only 5 minutes or maybe even slightly lower than 5 minutes. And that's the end for today everyone, I really hope that you enjoyed that. If you did, it would mean a lot to me if you can leave a like down below. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so, that would mean so much more. And stay tuned for the next video because the next one is even more insane than this. Check this out. By the time I was done hatching all of these exclusive Halloween chests, I made it to the leaderboard without even realizing it and that's all for today everyone i really hope that you have a wonderful day or evening wherever you are in the world and i'll see you all on the next one